I've had no communications with the governor. Uh, I don't have the faintest idea of what's going through his mind. I think watching on television, his comments indicate that he doesn't realize how serious the situation is for the people of Illinois. The people come first. The governor's personal interest does not come first. I think he has to realize that the public interest demands that he step aside or resign. Uh, otherwise, he will be removed. And I think Governor Bogoyevich, uh, if he really wants to serve the public and fulfill his oath of office, he will resign. I think a special election is in order, that we need to have uh, that to clear the air. And I have no objection to a special election as long as the people of Illinois are not disenfranchised in the United States Senate. So I do believe that the governor or acting governor should have the uh, ability to name a temporary appointment to the United States Senate so we have two senators from day one when they reconvene. Uh, there are going to be decisions made in our country by the United States Senate that will affect us for the rest of our lives. Momentous decisions about war and peace, about the economy, and we all know what our serious condition our economy is in. I do not think the people of Illinois, 13 million people, the fifth largest state in the union, should go without full representation in the United States Senate. There is no way to have a special election before the Senate reconvenes and gets sworn in. I believe it's on January 6th of 2009. So I think any uh, bill or law regarding a special election must deal with this situation where there will be a gap.